Hello, how are you? How are you today? Hello, teacher. How are you? Great. Victor, how are you? I am fine. I am very tired, but uh, okay. I go to the BTM today. It's a long, it's a, a long way. A long trash. A long way. Uh huh. And traffic. It's terrible. a long day. Yes, three hours in traffic. If yeah. <laughs> that's too much. Gabriela, how are you? Hi, how are you, teacher? Welcome. I'm good. Nancy, hello. Jesus, how are you, Jesus? I'm fine, teacher. Um, right there, um, my host. Okay, cool. And Marianne, how are you? Adia, Anna, how are you today? Fine, thank okay. you. Ready? Yes, that is. <laughs> okay, and Carlos, welcome. Carla, how are you? Ready for today? No problem, good news, but there's something. I'm ready for the class teacher. Ready, that's great. That's great. So let's see, let's begin with, yesterday we were practicing the question, what do you do? Or what's your job, right? And we were uh, reading, practicing, and uh, practicing pronunciation with the professions or jobs, right? And there you have the jobs that we practiced yesterday. And that's what we are going to do today. Um, let's see. No problem with this vocabulary? No. Second, somebody else is here. Hello, Lindsay, Carla, Rolando. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Um, try to switch your camera, okay? Try, please. Remember that you need to. You have to, okay? And it's better so I can see you. It's more interactive, okay? All right, let's see. What do you say, uh, desorden? How do you say desorden? Messi, like Leo Messi, Messi. I have a Messi in my bedroom. <laughs> ah, don't worry. I guess everybody does. That's not a problem. No sé, creo que todos tenemos desorden. <laughs> okay, so um oops comenzó a llover. The rain started. Yesterday we practiced jobs, cashier. Uh, let's try to pronounce the words very quickly. 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 Uh, the first one, everybody. Cashier, repeat in your bedroom. Cook, chef, doctor, flight attendant, judge, lawyer, 
musician, nurse, pilot, police officer, receptionist, salesperson, a security guard, singer, waiter, and waitress. And then uh, workplaces or the place where these people work. For example, a doctor. A doctor works. Where does a doctor work? And pay attention to the question. Where does a doctor work? Where does a doctor work? It's a hospital. In a, yes. Give me surgery, surgery. Ah, sinceramente no le entendí. Uh, I mean, ¿Cuál es el trabajo de un doctor? No, where, where the place. ¿Dónde? Where does a doctor work? The place. So, a doctor works in a hospital. Mm -hmm. A nurse works in a hospital. Now, another question. Where, where, where does a, a receptionist work? In a, hotel. in a hotel in a hotel in a hotel mm -hmm. where does listen where does a waiter work in the restaurant in a restaurant yes where does A teacher work. Teacher is not here, right? Where does a teacher work? In the school. Yes. Where does a security guard work? A security guard? In a store? In a store, yes. Where does a salesperson work? It is not in the list. Or where does a chef work? In the restaurant. In a restaurant. Where does... Ah, yeah, salesperson is there. Where does a cashier work? In Japan. Yes. Okay. La respuesta, ¿cómo sería? Solo okay. in the... Oh. Oh. In, a, in a bank. Like this. There you have in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel. So you can say... A cashier works in a hotel. A doctor works in a hospital. A, a security guard works in a store. Mm -hmm. That's it. All right, let's practice a conversation. There you have, he works in a hotel. So Rachel and Angela are speaking. So I need two volunteers. Who wants to be Rachel? Who wants to be Angela? Maria Anna. Rachel, another volunteer.
come on, ladies or a boy, a man, Rolando, Maria Ana and Rolando. Where does your brother work? In the auto. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel to his from this agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What what hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh that's interesting. What does he do? What does he I told do? you he is the manager? Cool. Did you understand the idea there? Uh, now I'm going to read it. Listen, pay attention. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Okay, two more volunteers. O sea, que lo hicimos mal, teacher. No, come on, no. Actually, I'm sorry, actually, antes de eso les iba a decir, me gusta, you have a, a good pronunciation. Good pronunciation. Now, um, es diferente pronunciación que entonación. La entonación se va también adquiriendo eh, para darle como el ritmo. ¿Verdad? El ritmo a las palabras. No solo pronunciar bien las palabras, sino el, el ritmo. Pero de hecho, se me chispoteó, como dicen. Les iba a decir que uh, uh, that's a good pronunciation. It was okay. It was okay. Okay. Ya Now, podemos, Rolando. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I like it. I like it. You, and that's the idea to, to practice because if you repeat every day, you, you get better. Así se mejora. Okay. Uh, okay. Thank you. Lo leí por dos situaciones. Para que escucharan cómo van las palabras. Y luego les iba a preguntar si también han visto los videos. Porque ahí también pueden escuchar la pronunciación. ¿Verdad? Y aquí solo lo ponemos en práctica ya en parejas. Pero en los videos pueden eh, escuchar la pronunciación. Good, no, congrats, congratulations. So I need two more volunteers. Kenya, Rachel. Next. Carlos, excellent. Okay, uh, Kenya, you start. Where does your brother in auto? He, he is a friend. Who well, does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What other does he for work? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? 
actually his manager. Nice. Thank you very much. Do. What does he do? Uh huh. What does he do? Good. Very good. Um. Actually. 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 He's the manager. Actually. He's the manager. And. And the intonation, as I told you, for example, in, in this, it says, um, that's too bad. That's too bad. It's like, hey, que mal. That's too bad. Mm -hmm. Very good. Two more volunteers. Someone. Jesus, ¿cómo se pronuncia in yes. interesting? Así. Okay, that's correct. Uh, you can say interesting, 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 interesting. And también he escuchado como interesting, interesting. But I like interesting. Interesting. Okay, I prefer this one. Interesting. So, volunteers for the conversation. I am teacher. Okay, and Gabriela. Gabriela, you are Rachel. Okay. Where does your brother work? I am a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in... in a hotel. He is front desk agent. Sorry, guys, something happened here. I was checking. Nice. Uh, I was listening, but I disappeared for a minute, okay? And I don't know if you have your um, manuals. No? Yes? <laughs> no, no yet. It's early. It's 8 and 20 minutes. Come on. Too early. Apenas si tenemos una hora, y van 20 minutos. Ok, um, comment, ok, what we are going to practice in this, no, but the question, my question is, do you have the manual? The, did you download the manual? No. No descargaron el manual. Yes. Sí, yes. Sí, lo descargué y ya luego de clase lo voy a imprimir. Okay, cool. Uh, because in this case, what we are going to practice is um, questions. But in this case, WH questions. Previously, we practiced um, just no questions, right? Uh, for example, do you work? Does he work? But in this case, if you notice, we're going to practice WH questions. Question with what, when, where, why, who, 
or how those WH questions. And I'm going to show you, let's see. I'm going to use this. for the explanation again okay? how to formulate questions But before I forget the attendance, okay? I'm going to check the attendance. Try not to miss classes. Uh, Tuesday 10. Alison, Rachel, Celis, Ortiz. No. Carlos Andrés Pacheco Calderón. Here. Thank you. Cristian Alexander Pérez Portillo. No. Come on, guys. Don't miss too many classes. Gabriela Alejandra González Cuellar. I'm here, present. Thank you. Jesus Antonio Artiaga Benitez. Present. Jose Alexander Pacas Alvarez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Carla Elizabeth Hernandez Peña. Present. Thank you. Kenia Briseida Torres Martinez. Present. Kimberly Janine Aguillon Lopez. No. Lindsay Indira Lobo Diaz. Present teacher. Nice. Maria Ana de Jesus Gonzalez. Present. Perfect. Maria Stephanie Orellana Flores. Present teacher. Perfect. Nancy Adit Cruz Mejia. Present. And Rolando Daniel Urrutia Salazar. Present. Tania Stephanie Rivera Landaverde. I'm worried. She was not here yesterday. Veronica Magali Martinez Martinez. No. Okay. Victor Manuel Guardado Torres. Present coach. Thank you very much. And Vilma Rubenia Campos Martinez. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Thank you, Alison. Alison. Okay. Teacher, este, yo creo que me nombró, pero no, o sea, no lo escuché porque estaba conectando mis audífonos. Y cuando estaba pasando, o sea, ya había pasado mi nombre. Por eso uh, no dije. Okay, aquí uh, estaba. ok, ok. Thank you very much. Um, No problem, right? Okay, perfect. Let's go here. Okay, WH questions, okay? WH questions. How or what do we do here? We have the WH words, right? 
what, when, where, um, who, but I'm not going to include who right now, what, when, where, uh, why, okay? There you have, those are WH words to formulate questions. And after this, we use the auxiliary, do or does, right? In this case, I'm going to use what. What do, and then the subject, what do you do? Mm. I'm, I'm going to change the verb. What do you watch? What do you watch on TV? Okay. Another one. Again, when do you watch television? This is like the formula for the questions, if you notice. <clears throat> and obviously, we can change the subject. We can say, where do uh, your parents, oops, parents work, okay? Where do your parents work? And then why, why do, why do we, you and me, why do we learn or practice? Why do we practice English? Now, if you notice, we have the same pattern, the same order, order you see? And that's what you have to do in order to formulate questions, okay? The same order. And if you notice, uh, I'm trying to separate so you can see the order of the words, okay? And this is, let's say, the complement here. We separate here. So if you notice the same pattern, the same order, sometimes um, you're going to change something. For example, in, in the first one. Um, but I'm going to explain that a little bit later. Now check the order. What do you watch? When do you watch? Where do your parents work? Why? Why do we practice English? In this case, um, you can see this is the subject and this one. And in this case, it's the complete phrase your parents, in this case, we, okay? And the auxiliary do in the questions, okay? Do you get the idea? Yes. Yeah. And then, um, Let's suppose, let's see, because uh, we use do or does, right? It depends for he, she, it. So I can modify this and I can write what does. Now, why? Because I'm going to speak about she, you see? What does she watch on TV? 
in the second, what does he? Okay, I change the auxiliary because the subject is different. The subject is he or she. And where does, in this case, um, I'm going to change parents and I'm going to write mom, your mom, to mama. Where does your mom work? Why does, why does, and I'm going to change for your dog. Why does your dog And I'm going to change the complement. Why does your dog sleep too much? ¿Por qué duerme mucho tu mascota, tu perro? And there you have. Okay? That's how we formulate questions. Mm -hmm. Rolando? Ahí también se aplicaría el, por ejemplo, el it. Yes, in, in your dog. In this case, uh, I can say it. Okay. Why does it sleep too much? Pero si acá pongo el it. <clears throat> no sabríamos a qué se está recibiendo, a, a qué se está refiriendo el it. Por eso puse dog. ¿Ok? Why does, um, para que tengas un contexto, why does your dog eh, es eso? Why does your dog sleep too much? Entonces podríamos decir, um, it, ya nos estamos refiriendo al perro, digamos que es una mini conversation. Alguien pregunta y alguien responde. Why does your dog sleep too much? Ah, it, it sleeps too much, duerme mucho. Because it is sick. Porque está enfermo. Okay. There you have. And we have sleep with S. Por lo mismo, por ser tercera persona. Why does your dog sleep too much? It sleeps too much because it... It is sick. Okay. In this case, we can write uh, my dog. Si omitiéramos el it y el responder, el, podemos responder. My dog sleeps too much because. Y podríamos poner acá también. My dog is sick. Okay. <clears throat> Ahí el, el lead sustituye al, al dog, al nombre. Okay. So, that's a good question. Good. Thank you. Any other question? Comment? Todo bien, todo bien. Perfect. Someone else? It's okay. So, let's change this. And Let's complete these questions. Complete these conversations. Then practice with a partner.
So let's do it. You have the example. What does your sister do? My sister, she's a nurse. Next question. And in this case, um, let's go to the conversation again. And if you notice this question, how, how does she like it? How does she like it? Como interpretan la pregunta? How does she like it? It says, oh, really? My brother works in a hotel, too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. So the question is, it can be, ¿Qué tanto le gusta? ¿Qué tanto le gusta? El empleo. Y le dice, not very much. No mucho. Not very much. Mm -hmm. No mucho. So, in this conversation, right here, it says, what does your sister do? My sister, she's a nurse. So, the question, here, how how does she like it like it perfect how does she like it it's difficult but she loves it es difícil pero le encanta it's difficult but she loves it good number two does your brother What's the question? Yeah, where? Where, where does yeah. your brother? Where yeah. does? Uh -huh. Where does your brother? Work. Work. Yes. Where does your work. brother work? Where does your brother work? At the airport. He's a pilot. Oh, the question? También se puede decir job, ¿verdad? No. Sí. Mm, not. Not exactly. You cannot use, in this question, where does your brother job? Uh-uh. You cannot use job. Job no puede ser verbo. Mm -hmm. Job es nombre. Yo puedo decir my job. My job is my job is difficult. My job is difficult. Mi empleo, mi trabajo es difícil. Ok. Pero no puedo decir I job every day. The correct one is I work every day. In this case, where does your brother work? At the airport. He's a pilot. Next question. Oh. How? How does he? Like. Like it. How does he like it? How does he like it? He doesn't really like it. He doesn't really like it. Conversation number three. Question. When do your parents... Like it there, your jobs? Like. How do... How do your parents like their jobs? How do your parents like their jobs? Oh, I guess they like them. 
I don't remember. Question. Sería, where do they work? Exactly. Where do they work? In an office in the city. Perfect. Conversation number four. What do you do? What do you do? I'm a student. I see. Question. How do you like? How do you like your classes? They're good. I like them a lot. They're good. I like them a lot. Perfect. I want to try something. I need two volunteers. And you are going to do this. In this case, you have Ben, Claudia, Vicky, and Owen. So I want you to have a conversation speaking about Ben. Who wants to try? Uh, you can use those questions to make the conversation. Who wants to try? Any volunteer? Nobody. For example, we are going to use the same questions, okay? We are going to recycle the questions. Vamos a reciclar las preguntas. Example, pay attention. Eh, haré la conversación como conmigo mismo. Listen. Number one, Ben. Uh, what does Ben do? Um, he is a waiter. Oh, good. Where does he work? Oh, uh, he works at Pizza Hut. Commercial. Mm -hmm. um, how does he like it? Mm, he doesn't like it very much. You see? Only that. Or we can say, uh -huh, that's enough, only those questions. So now, Claudia, who wants to have the conversation about Claudia? Volunteer. I, I mean, I need two volunteers for the questions and the answers. Cualquier pregunta con tal que sea relacionado al trabajo. Yes. The first asks, yeah. what do you do, Claudia? I am a doctor. Okay, okay, okay. Victor, yeah, perfect. Pero lo vamos a hacer en dos, a ver si, si hay otro participante, another volunteer. Así hace las preguntas y el compañero las contesta. Who? Any volunteer?
No. Come on, try. Okay, so I'm going to do it with Victor and later I need two more volunteers. Okay, Victor, so you ask me and I am going to answer. Hi, Claudia, what do you do? I am a nurse. Oh, really? Cool. Where do you work? I work in a hospital. In the hospital San Antonio. Do you like this? I like it very much. Why? Uh, because I like to help people. Oh, really? It's so interesting. It is. Finish him. Yeah, you see, very short. So, who wants to try? No. Mm. I don't speak English. <laughs> but you can try. No, no, understand. Okay, what you need to do is, I mean... Difficult. Sometimes it is, but something that you can do is, I mean... um. Let's see here. You need the well, you you have to try to understand the questions. Let's suppose three, four questions. Uh, for example, I, I'm going to have the conversation with you as an example. Okay. We are going to have a, a short conversation, Jose Alexander Pacas Alvarez. I'm going to make the questions and you answer. Yo pregunto, usted contesta. Yes? Yes. Okay. What do you do, Jose? In, in a hospital. No, no, you. What do you do? Uh, okay. Uh, I am a uh, officer police. Okay. Where do you work? Uh, in in a a n s p. Okay. Mm, what time do you work? Uh, what time? Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Yes. Uh, uh, I I is este uh, six uh twenty uh, Okay. And do you like your job? Yes. Perfect. Good. And that's it. If Si comprenden las preguntas, esas mismas las puede hacer alguien más. Y ahí se, ahí se mantiene la conversación. Y hay comunicación. You see? If you understand the questions, esas preguntas son las que se están practicando. Y así es como se van creando las mini conversations. Uh -huh. ah, ok. Y ahí... Es, Y acá están las preguntas. Where do you work? What do you do? Eh, es lo que les digo. Entender la pregunta y saber cómo contestarla. Okay. Where do you work? ¿Dónde trabajas? What do you do? ¿Cuál es tu empleo? Porque acá dicen, where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I am a doctor. How do you like it? I really like it. Um, ¿Dónde trabajas? En un hospital. ¿A qué te dedicas? 
soy doctor, ¿qué tanto te gusta? Me gusta bastante. ¿Ok? That's it. There you have the question. Well, you have to, you have to memorize, memorize the questions and practice the questions. Mm -hmm. That's it. Uh, let's see if I remember. Uh, I'm going to ask. What do you do, Vilma? I am a student. Okay. Where do you study? In the University Gerardo Barrios in San Miguel. Okay. How do you like your classes? Y si me gustan las clases. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I really like it. Easy. Mm -hmm. What do you do, Gabriela? I am a lawyer. A lawyer. Where do you work? Um, in the city. Eh, in the juzgado, ¿cómo se dice? Courthouse. Courthouse. Court, como casa de la corte. Courthouse. Courthouse, mm -hmm. okay. How do you like it? Yes, really, I like it. And do you work every day? No, and uh, I work two days. Only two days. Perfect. Yes. Thank you. Let's see. What do you do? I'm checking your names here. What do you do, Lindsay? I am a lawyer. A lawyer. A lawyer of sí. lawyers. Yes. Qué bueno, me voy a ser amigo de muchos abogados. <laughs> sí. Okay, a lawyer. Yes. Good. And um, where do you work? Que lo saquen. Yes, exactly. Ahí <laughs> <laughs> le voy a llamar. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> where do you work? Lindsay. Where? Well, uh, um. I don't know. Where? Uh, I am court suprema de de justice or justice. No sé, justicia. Justice. 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 Uh -huh. Justice. Yes. And when? When do you work? I worked two days. Two days. Uh -huh. Only two days. Okay. Uh, how do you like it? I really like it. Perfect. Thank you, Lindsay. <laughs> Thanks. That's nice. Pero estaba pensando mientras platicaba con Lindsay que mejor me hago amigo de José Alexander para que no me meta. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. Es más barato. <laughs> okay. Yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. Nos pondremos de acuerdo. <laughs> Le digo en inglés. No, José, I, I don't want to go to jail. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. Now, to finish, I need two volunteers. Ahora. Entre ustedes, I need two volunteers. Questions and answers. Para que tengan la mini conversation. 
<laughs> no, aquí encerradito no me atrapan. I'm teaching English. <laughs> I <don't know>. No. <laughs> okay, two volunteers. Quickly. A mini conversation to volunteers, to volunteers. Rolando, okay. Next. Rolando uno. Next volunteer. Jesus, do you want to try? Voy a preguntar o puedo responder. Mm, questions. Sure, okay. Okay. So, Jesús, the questions, uh, Rolando, the answers. Uh, what do you do, Rolando? ¿Verdad? I'm a student uh, and you? I am a Shani. Um, where do you study? A student in university. De El Salvador. Or, ¿cómo se dice? Bueno, la Universidad Nacional. U.S. You can say U.S. Ajá, U.S. Uh, I'm studying in U.S. Uh, who do you like it? Um, uh, se puede decir, I love it. In my... I love it. Uh, I love it. Uh -huh. in, no, I love it. My, ¿cómo se dice? Carrera. Uh, Carri me, career. Career. I love, I love it. My career. Yes. Aunque en este caso, si decís my career, omitís el it. I love my career. Uh -huh. Porque acuérdense que el pronombre sustituye al nombre. Pero entonces, si decís el nombre, no necesitas el pronombre. En, en este caso... Eh, sería I love my career. What is your career? Uh, li licencia, no, licenciatura en relaciones internacionales. Vamos, sí. Puede que se muera. Puede que se muera. No, tengo el gran artículo. No, 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 Okay. All right, guys. Let's see. Good, 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 good. The time is over. Yeah, I'm hungry. Uh, comments, questions, questions about questions. Creo que mañana deberíamos de practicar un poquito más esta este tema. It's, it's a little difficult. Yes, it is. It is. Uh, we need time uh, to practice. Si se necesita eh, suficiente tiempo para, para este tema. Es amplio, un tanto complicado. Hay que manejarlo bien. Eh, pero aprendiéndose, digamos, la, como la, lo que les decía al inicio, la fórmula ¿no? de cómo van. Tipo matemática, ¿no? qué es lo que va primero, qué es lo que sigue, y luego 
como ese sería el patrón, la fórmula, porque así mismo se van formulando ya otro tipo de preguntas, usando el mismo patrón, ¿sí? Entonces, por eso es eh, la importancia del manual y el, el, el practicar ahí los, eh, las preguntas. Eh, ¿Quién estudia por la U es que me lo pueda imprimir? <risa> oh, voy a... Um, igual a intentar hacer algo porque yo tengo este libro y les voy a... O les voy a, <coughs> a compartir algunos links. Oh, ok. Unos links donde van a encontrar variedad para que puedan practicar las preguntas. Ok. Sí, sí. So, good night, everyone. Thank you very much for your attendance. Thank you for your participation, okay? And I will see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Hi, everyone. Good night, teacher. Good night, everyone. Good evening. Good night, everyone.